you look at this. Rolex, 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 everywhere you look. Yo, 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 what's up, people? This is your boy, Pete Ross, back in the building with another video. Okay, first of all, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, hit that sub button to support your boy, and don't forget to check out the SoCal Watch Reviews podcast. Episode 43 was off the chain. Now, like I said I was going to do, I'm going to review these watch straps from Archer starting with probably my favorite the handmade leather strap which is so so comfortable see it here on my hamilton acumatic a-507 this strap is legit i love the soft leather and construction of the strap i think the color fits well and with my vintage hamilton it has a quick release function which makes it very easy to change whenever you get ready to so a plus on this one I really like this strap here okay people next up is this gray nylon two-piece strap I feel like it went well with my Omega C master DeVille the quality on this strap is pretty good I feel the gray brings out the color of the dial of the Omega and this strap also has a quick release function. I don't know about y'all, but after dealing with these Archer straps, yeah, I have I have had quick release straps before, but I am really, really digging the quick release strap. It's like in and out, done, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta worry about no, no, no tool sticking you if you can't get the pin out right and all that. I love the quick release function. Not only that, this gray strap is very comfortable on the wrist, and I thought that this was a great combo for sure, and I really enjoyed this one. I feel like the gray color is vibrant and stands out most definitely, and I took it off the wrist, and I'm gonna turn it around here in a second. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna take a look at the buckle. The steel on this thing is good. Uh, 316L stainless steel, and on the back, you can see the Archer sign on the back of the buckle and there go the quick re release function, which is great. And again, very comfortable strap. And here we go with the gray silicone strap. I also have this one in orange and black and they are very comfortable on the wrist. As you see, I have the watch um, that I think is a classic is the Timex Easy Reader. I thought this was a great combo, another gray strap with a vibrant color. Now we're gonna take a closer look at the strap itself. There's the buckle, you know, it's polished and it definitely matches the polishing on the Timex Easy Reader. You know what I mean? Um, ooh, I love the Easy Reader. You know what I'm saying? The numerals on there is awesome. Um, now I'm gonna turn it around and as you can see the Archer buckle has the stamp on it and this is also has a quick release function which i am definitely feeling it really makes me want to buy quick release straps from now on but this is the gray silicone strap last and certainly not least we have the archer nato the black green and red you know what i mean i really love this color combination with my hamilton khaki you know what i mean i think this was fun this definitely was bomb. My only reserve about this strap, but first let me let me give the positives. Um, this is definitely a thick, and it definitely is a nice NATO. Um, it's thick. I feel like the stainless steel on it is good. My only reserve is I wish what Archer would have done was maybe put the Archer logo on the stainless steel buckles. I think that would have really turned this piece out. Maybe for future reference, they may want to do that, but I feel like that would have been an extra added to this piece. You know what I'm saying? With well, a strap, of course. So get into it. This your boy, Pete Ross. Um, Archer definitely have some of the best watch straps in the game. Go check them out for sure. This your boy, Pete Ross. And I'm out. Peace.